Hey guys, I wanted to make this video really quick. Um, something, something was just brought to my attention, which uh, I knew about, but um, I, I haven't really talked about it because uh, I didn't really want to take guys away with it, from it until I heard today um, that possibly, possibly Chile is in our area again, in the Huntington, Ashton, Ironton area, uh, especially in Huntington, West Virginia. Now, I don't know how true this is. I don't know if it's just uh, rumor or hearsay. The reason why he would be here is due to the fact there was a young woman, a young girl, uh, 13 years old. Uh, her name was Lainey. Uh, and she got, um, I'm going to say murdered uh, by an off-duty police officer uh, who, in my opinion, in my opinion, this shouldn't have happened. Um, it's tragic. It's awful. Um, people have every right to be pissed off. Um, you know, I, I always said, you know, not all cops are good. Not all cops are bad. Uh, and we see a lot of bad cops. Now, does this, does this make me think that all cops are bad? No, no, I, I still don't think that. Um, do I think what happened here is awful? Fuck yeah, I, I believe it's really awful. Um, and I believe the, the officer that's done this um, should be in deep shit, should possibly go to jail, um, and not just get a slap on the wrist. Uh, I know the investigation is going. Uh, there are protests. Um, a lot of sadness, a lot of sadness in this area. And my heart goes out to the family um, that has to deal with this. Um, I can imagine, you know, I, you know, I don't have kids, but I can imagine losing a child, uh, let alone anybody else. Um, the reason why I wanted to make this video is because apparently rumor is Chile de Castro is in the area. Um, and I have seen that he had made some live streams immediately about this. Now, I don't know. I don't know if the family has talked to Chile, but let me go ahead and warn you. You don't want to associate with this guy. You don't. You, I know you want answers. I know you want justice. I know you want um, people to know about this, but he's not the person to associate with when it comes to this. Um, you know, I like he he is a he is very into opportunities to grow his channel to make money and hurt people that are in the crossfire. You can go back, watch his content, you can watch all the people that's talked about him. You can see the victims. He says there's no victims. I'm telling you, if you're a family member and you want your daughter to have justice, having him come in on this is not the way to do it. Uh, it's only going to hurt things. It's going to make things worse. Um, he's going to use your daughter as a way to heighten him, to make himself more famous. He's not famous. He can't help you. He will take the money from you. And he will walk away. He will make things worse for you. I'm not lying to you. Um, you know, he he knows what he's doing. He's a very big opportunist. He's a Hollywood uh, dropout that's just looking for fame. Uh, he's done this to a lot of families. Uh, you know, I, I'm sorry that you lost your daughter. I, I, I apologize. I, I hate that. I want justice for Laney, too. Um, but don't go to him. Don't do it. Uh, if he is in your vicinity, if he's asking to come to you, asking to give you money, uh, asking to do anything for you, don't do it. I'm, uh, it's it's awful. It's a bad idea. Um, it's only going to make things worse. Uh, it's 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 bad. It's really bad. And I, you know, I can't even stress. I can't even stress it. Um, you know. I don't like to see people get hurt, and this is going to make things worse. 
uh, delete walls is not the answer. It's not. He's not the answer. He's a sham. He's a scammer. He will take your money and run. And he'll tarnish, tarnish your daughter's legacy and make it all about him. And this is true. This is all true. It might be my opinion. But in my opinion, this is all true. And the people in Huntington, the people that's, you know, standing up for this, that's the right thing to do. Protesting is the right thing to do. But bringing him, bringing him in is not the right thing to do. Uh, he'll, he'll promise you the world. He'll say he'll do this. He has no authority. He has no insiders. Um, he's not going to help you. He's just going to make things absolutely a nightmare. But, you know, I'll, I'll post this. You can take my word for it. You, you don't have to. This is me being concerned. I lived in this community. Uh, I love this community. I, you know, you might call me a bootlicker. That's fine. But I'm here to tell you not all cops are good. Not all cops are bad. But this is this is a mistake bringing him in the, on it. Um, if, if you want to talk to somebody, um, there's a lot of people that would talk to you. That would help you out. There's a lot of families uh, that feel your pain right now, your struggles. Um, that little girl had a life to live, and it got taken away by somebody that was careless. Now, like I said, this stuff may be getting covered up, and you can we can line that up with corruption within the police state. Or we could say there was one bad cop. I don't want to say that it's all cops, but I do want to say that in this case, there was an injustice, a life lost unfairly. But don't bring Chile de Castro in on this. I, I promise you it would be the biggest mistake you've made. I promise you this. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. And um, if you want somebody to talk to, um, there's a lot of people that will talk to you. I can talk to you. I can't help you. Um, I can't help you get your daughter back. But I can talk to you at least. But don't bring him in on this. This is the worst mistake you could possibly make. Um, I promise you this. I promise you. I'll talk to you soon.